the USC Rasir School of Education is excited to announce its new program, Masters of Education in Learning Design and Technology. And we really developed it with the recognition of learning happening outside the traditional classroom in places such as museums, the military, the corporations. Learning happens in many non-formal and informal learning environments, and there's an increasing recognition of this type of learning. So this program is a 21-month online program um, where students will actually engage in learning research-based principles to support learning in a variety of formal, non-formal, and informal learning environments. The Masters of Learning Design and Technology will prepare its graduates to be effective educators in all learning situations. Here in the heart of urban Los Angeles, designers of informal learning environments are applying the principles of this program with a particular focus on the importance of technology in learning. In informal learning, technology plays a huge role. It's important to use appropriate technologies as a tool to enhance the content, to help bring it to life and to be able to find ways to illustrate that content in meaningful and memorable ways. Well, learning is taking place where people are and where they aren't, within institutions and between institutions. So how do you structure that space, that ability to be able to have people learn wherever they need to be or end up being? We want our students to know that, know how media and technology integrate to facilitate that, and to use that as part of their instructional design strategy. We will be tapping into USC-wide expertise in learning and motivation, instructional design, communication, gaming, uh, cinematography. We have fantastic people here who will be contributing to this program. This is a tremendous growth area in the next five years. We're going to see growth rates of up to 22 percent just in the field of education when it comes to learning design and technology. The need for informal educators has grown greatly recently. Educators that can design, that can implement, that can evaluate these type of learning situations is essential to being able to promote a holistic approach to learning. The Institute for Creative Technologies is focused on uh, the future of immersive environments, particularly for learning and for training. We are already employing people who've come through Rossier and understand this process and have actually developed this process that we have at ICT. Students graduating will find a number of resources at their disposal in terms of helping them with their career management both during the program as well as after. For jobs in their fields from Los Angeles to around the world. I'm excited to see what the students coming out of this program bring to the world. We need more informal educators and people who can create these dynamic learning settings that provide for a holistic learning. I will be really excited to meet the graduates from this program and have the opportunity to interview them or to recommend them uh, to my peers and other institutions. Uh, I think they're going to be adding great value to the world of learning. There's definitely an increasing need for professionals in the world of designed learning environments with the recognition, with the increasing recognition of non-formal and informal learning that happens. And this is what this program really teaches.